Hello and welcome. My name is Liu Oshan. Today I will going to present about our Deborah project which title Light Efficient System. Before we entering the title, I would like to make some briefing for our product. We found that light system in Malaysia consists of some problem which is they cannot adjust its brightness automatically. This being annoying thing. They may be too dark or too bright for a room when the light system cannot adjust the brightness. As we know, the weather of Malaysia is changing frequently. This means that we need to close the light if it is too bright and open the light if it is too dark. We also need to adjust the brightness of the light manually to make sure that the brightness is comfortable. In this case, most of the industry in Malaysia choose to open the light all the day to make sure that the work space is bright enough. However, this is quite wasteful since most of the electric energy go to waste for the light system when it is not necessary. Here are some examples we get from Google. It proved that the weather of the Malaysia changes frequently but by referring to the ground. We can see that the graph is moving up and down just in a single week. To overcome this problem, we get the idea from the roof window. The roof window is a system that already been designed long time ago. Its purpose is to allow the sunlight to enter the room to decrease the use of electric energy for lighting a system. It had already been modified into many different types which is skylight, sun tunnel and flat roof skylight. It's a great idea since it is an efficient idea to decrease the use of electric energy. It has been cooked in other countries but not us. Since our weather is changed frequently, we will found that the design is quite annoying if we use it in our industry. So most of the industry in Malaysia did not use it. Still, some of the industry has used it but not in the workplace. They use it in the corridor which does not require the brightness. So come to the question. Can we design a system to help our industry to reduce the cost of the electric energy for lighting system? After the discussion, we have come to the idea that we can design an electric system that help to overcome this problem. To make it possible, we have set the objective for our deploy project which is to develop a product that provide light efficiently to develop a product that is suitable to installing in Malaysia home and industry. To reduce the usage of electricity with the efficient light system and to optimize the energy for procurements and utilization. We also have collect some data from public to make sure that our product can match their requirement and perform the best function for them. In order to collect the data, we had designed a survey with values of questions and options for the public to fill up. We have included some necessary questions for our survey to make sure that the data we collect is related to our product and make our product more better. We also have made the data we collect in the simple to understand by compiling all the data into pie chart. Besides that, we have done some research from the internet to collect the data from others. We have read a lot of books, articles, magazines, blog spots, and watch videos that relate to our product to make sure that our idea and product is possible and useful for industry. We also have compiled all the data we collect into files and remove the unnecessary reference from the file and remain the reference that we need. Here are some data we collect from the survey. After collecting and analysis all the data, 
we had done some drawing, sketching to decide the design of the, our product. We had draw a house to plan the position we want, the place for our electric circuit. We also had draw the window for the housing, sketching and sketch more detailed window to make sure that our window is easy to understand. Besides, we have designed and sketched the electric circuit that we want. We also had already modified many times for electric circuit by referring to the data we collect before to make sure that the circuit that we make can work properly. After done sketching, we move to the 3D modeling. We use the Fusion 360 to design the window frame and window glass. We had designed the window frame in L shape and made some hole for the frame to screw all the uh, frame on at the wall. We also had designed up the glass window to make sure that it fit to the frame that we designed in 3D modeling. Next, we had used the Tindercat to design the electric circuit. We had used the resistor LED transistor, potential meter, light sensor, and the electric source for our circuit. This is a final design that we designed afterward. The design worked well according to the expectation. After that, we had designed out our prototype. We had used stick to design the house according to the 3D modeling and used the breakboard to design the circuit. We did not use the electric circuit because it cannot work. Consisting since our soldering skill is not perfect, it caused problem after some time. So we used breakboard to solve the problem and it worked. We also modify the sensor to make it close to the window so that it become more sensitive and accurate. We also mix and move out the battery and photo potential meter to the outside so that it is more easy to adjust the circuit. Here are the video that we got for our prototype. For the sustainability factor, our research so that amount of electric energy for lightning system in industry is huge. It has consumed 6% of the total electric energy in industry. This huge things, the total energy consumed of industry is large, so we sure that the system will make able to decrease the use of electric energy by using the solar energy for the lightning system. In this case, our system also can make sure that the brightness of the workspace will reduce the usage of the electric energy. This makes it more efficient compared to the previous design which only apply the window in the industry. For the view of material, we have calculated the circuit board will be around 25 to 50 ringgit depend to the range of the light sensor. The window will be around 200 if it is a standard size. If it is bigger, it will be more expensive. For the industry that already got the window, they can just apply our circuit board to make the system more efficient. In conclusion, our product will help to adjust the brightness of the bulb depending to the brightness of the sunlight. 
this will reduce the electric consumption of industry and resident. It also a step for us to future decrease the electrical needed to produce and save our limited resources to make our world become more better. For extra information, you may refer to our poster and report that we make. That's all from us. Thank you for watching.